Hello everyone, today in this video we will be discussing the module 1 of Cryptography Supreme Point Questions and this uh, document link can be found in the description box, you can download it. So from each module I will be picking up 4 or 5 questions which are the most repeated ones along with the solutions where you can find the solutions if I am not able to uh, give the explanation for that everything I will be uh, giving you. So make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and let's get started. So in the cryptography this is the uh, whole syllabus because having a look at the syllabus only is the thing which is going to give us uh, information about what are the important topics and unimportant topics without looking at the syllabus it's uh, uh, stupidity to just see the important co uh, questions okay so we have two parts of the syllabus the first is a classical encryption techniques and second is block ciphers and the data encryption standard so see here the topics present in data encryption standard are so many right so data encryption standard is an important topic like that uh, you have to uh, get to know and in classical encryption techniques we have what is encryption and what is the standard encryption technique and some other techniques are also there so from other techniques which are the most two repeated that I have included in this uh, document and I'll be explaining what it actually does okay and what are the key points you have to write so let's get started the first question is explain the symmetric cipher model with a neat diagram okay very important this is the first topic itself see here symmetric cipher model so here you have to uh, draw this uh, diagram with five things here the plain text will be given as input and that will be encrypted by using some algorithm that you need not explain actually what is algorithm there are many algorithms for that then you will be getting a cipher text now if you have to decrypt the cipher text you'll be applying decryption algorithm and that will be decrypted again as a uh, plain text. These are the five steps you have to write and explain these key points in your own words. Go through this. This is taken from the Technities Engineers uh, notes. So make sure you download the notes and go through all the notes. And there are some important questions uploaded there as well. You can go through that and uh, prepare for the best. Okay. So let's get uh, with the second question. You explain the Playfair cipher rule. See how many uh, different techniques are there. Along with this, you have to uh, study other techniques as well. This is just the most important ones. Okay. So Playfair is somewhere here. Uh, Playfair is here. So this is the uh, one and you have other thing uh, there's also like substitution technique mono alphabetic and caesar these are also important okay but since i have restricted to four so i did not include all of the questions so um, in playfair what you have to actually do is you'll be having the letter given like for example here monarchy is given and uh, what you have to do is you have to write m o n a r c h y after i've written that you have to fill the remaining letters you have to make five cross five box and the remaining letters will be filled in such a manner that whatever letter you fill here it is in alphabetic order and that letter has not appeared here for example a has appeared here so i'll not write here b is there c is appeared here i'll not write c i'll write d here e is not there i'll write e f g and uh, h has appeared here so i'll not write h and i and j always will be in the same uh, cell okay like that some rules are there and whatever the uh, thing they give you if they ask you specifically for that thing you have to do for that thing okay and these are the five rules uh, if you are feeling a difficulty to understand in the link i have put a uh, uh, means uh, the in the description box i have put a link in which you can find the part one and part two for the same question they have solved uh, a youtube channel called as niso academy so you can watch their video it's a very nice one you can understand it totally make the notes and uh, perform your best in the exam next is the explain hill cipher technique in hill cipher technique also will be given with a word like here it is um, cryptography i guess the word is and you have to make some uh, matrix multiplication for example 217 is there and this uh, numbers again i don't know how actually these numbers came but uh, if you want this uh, Answer is also there in the uh, video in the link in the description box. The question paper question is there, which is uh, send more money. Okay, like that one question is there. Make sure you solve it. It was asked in June 2022. So you have to just multiply these matrices and one answer you will get. That answer which corresponds to which word that is uh, called as the uh, letters. Like if you get a bigger word, I think you will have to do the um, division or the modulus operator to get 25 and 20. Like that you will be doing and you will getting some words here. By using that words, you will be forming the cipher text. Okay, like that you have to do. That was about this one. You can um, see the link in the description box. There, I have uh, put a link. And uh, the last one is the explain DES encryption algorithm. In DES, also, there are many other topics. Let me point out what all you have to actually study in DES. See, in DES, you have the cipher structure and Feastal structure is also important. They can ask separately feastal structure, so I did not include in one uh, question only. The DES algorithm has one step which has feastal structure, and the feastal structure itself is a long algorithm. Okay, so uh, both can be asked for 10 marks, and it was asked in the previous uh, paper. So make sure you know this very well. And small concepts like avalanche effect can be asked for 4 marks, and um, design of function f and key schedule algorithm 
and use of 56 b uh, bit keys these are the important topics okay after you prepare for ds make sure you know these concepts also very well let's have a look at what is ds ds is nothing but some uh, parameters will be there 64 bit plain text number of run 16 and so on and uh, some steps will be performed in two iterations like 64 bit then the bits will be changed and the number of rounds will be changed some algorithms will be applied so uh, know this uh, concept very well just go through it once you'll get to know make sure the like button subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next one